Are you traveling this summer and you want to scrapbook while you travel? That's the best time to get your memories down. Well, you need to put this kit together. So I like to do pocket scrapbooking. So at home, I cut up all my little papers. I put them in order in a stack. I stack the embellishments and the things I want to go with them all together. And I put it in a little glassine bag. You could use a Ziploc bag too if you want. And then I put all of that into a makeup bag. I got this one on clearance at Target, but I've linked one down in the description that you can get right now because this one was on clearance. You also need to put a pen, some scissors, some adhesive, and I put an HP sprocket into the bag. What's cool about the sprocket is on your trip, you can actually print out your photos as you take them. So to print with the sprocket, you want to turn it on, choose the photos in the HP sprocket app, and then send the photo to print. And the thing that's really cool is while that's printing, you can edit other photos to get ready and put them in the queue to print. So on your trip, lay out the pieces to your little scrapbooking kit. And since you put them in order, you'll be able to lay them out in order so that it's in order on your, uh, it goes in the order of your pocket page and you can add your journaling. You can put some paper scraps in there to use as mats put your photos and what's great about sprocket is the photos are all stickers so you don't even need adhesive for that but I did put glue dots for the embellishments so while you're traveling even if you're in the middle of the page you can store everything back in the bag and then when you get home unpack all the pieces and then put them back into the page protector so I'm using divided pocket pages here which makes this super easy and small for travel scrapbooking. So I'd love to know if you are gonna use this idea and let me know where you are traveling this summer and where you're gonna be scrapbooking. Thanks for watching, bye.